at Soccer City. And we are underway with Kaiser Chiefs getting us started here. A highly anticipated matchup. Yeah. Basically, had to run the midfield alone for Sellies after they were reduced to to ten men early in the second period. And some feel it was on the strength of that performance that yeah, oh, yes. Devin Titus has been so influential for Stellenbosch this season. He's looking for the cutback for Andre De Jong. He'll get another opportunity here to find a teammate. Striding forward. Finding a little bit of space. Dina van Rooyen's out of position. To the force backwards. Here's Sitebe. Poor ball. Throw taken quickly. The Kaiser Chiefs caught lacking at the back. Big opportunity here. Well dealt with. Well, he'll celebrate his 23rd birthday in about a month. Stellenbosch put the ball in behind once again for the pacey Devin Titus. Who has made a massive contribution up front for Stellenbosch. When he goes on the overlap, uh, Titus is using that space that he's leaving behind. He doesn't connect well with that now that, that is aura. But let's give credit for um, Tetra that went to cover uh, uh, Santi. That is the His instructions. In swimming delivery from Basadin and causing a few problems. And in the end, uh, it comes to nothing. Pace to get in behind. To do this Shabalala. Teasing Torre. Will get the corner. Basadin. Ekron Reyners. Uda. As De Jong making the run into the box, it's set here for Titus. Lanti closed him down. He made mention of the fact uh, that he... Body profile. Body profile, yeah, it was all wrong. Now Kaiser Chiefs have a big chance here. It's over the crossbar. The anticipation, Modi takes over. He says, I've got four goals already this season. Mm. Let me take over this one. Looking for goal number five. But that was a little tug back there on Ekram Reynes, but he continues on. He slid it through here for Andre de Young, and it's rolled just past the uprights. And although it appeared as though it had been kept alive, the flag was indeed eventually oh, raised. Oh, de plays it to Titus. Titus is yeah, onside, but the whole circumference of the ball goes over the line. Correct call by the assistant ref. It does go out. The front angle will not tell the, yeah, the real story, story, but the side one will tell the real story. And from that side one, the whole... Toure had completed more successful passes for Stellenbosch this season. Now they're on the defensive, though. The visitors holding for Wandile Duba. Slanty back to Duba. Licked away from Jaden Adams, went gliding past a couple of players, but it fell to Ure. He found Ikram Reynes returns and shoots. A fierce effort. Be Shabalala. It's decent technique on that, just couldn't get the ball to dip down. But yeah, you're right, there's there's no one maybe barring uh, to Boho McQuena, but even he doesn't hit them with as much regularity as you would like. Two seasons back, he got a couple for Super Sports United, but he hasn't got more than one in a single season uh, other than that campaign. As Shabalala goes for it. That's the concentration from Stellenbosch. Nice pass from Basadin to find Ura. And he said, Ura, I was looking to bend it into that bottom corner. That uh, didn't get to uh, Cape Town City. There might be a chance here, though. Well, you have to wonder what the intention was there. Uh, a little bit of naivete. Now, oh, this could be a chance. Roll the cross and in. Stellenbosch, right before the interval, take the lead. Devin Titus appears to be claiming it. It's going made. to be key. Look at him making that run, the bucket mm. run on the shoulder of the last defender. He's in an onside position. Goal number 10 in all competitions now for, for Titus to go together with the three assists. A well-taken goal, but what about the pass coming from Dino van Rooyen, an excellent assist. To make a, a real contribution here. Yes. 
Dante Stevens makes the save. Against Christian Sail. He's always going to look to cut in. He's comfortable on both the right and the left. Um, he sees that uh, Toure gives him the space to go inside. And he welcomes that invite, cuts inside, and there's a shot uh, starting to want them to rush. They need to be patient. They need to remain focused. Yes, Mori. And he sees the pilot once again. Now he's hooked it into the area for Dupre, who heads wide. Not one of his best attributes, uh, Dupri, but a good run that he makes in this instance. Toure clears a uh, Modi correctly positioned to pick up that second ball again. The second phase is still in charge, but could Dupri have taken a touch? Could Dupri have maybe so the Pirates with a brace this evening as Dino van Rooyen slips it through to De Jong, who was flagged for offside, belatedly so. Could Van Rooyen have continued without the assistance from Dion? Oh, man. It's nowhere near being offside. Not even close. Onside. Nothing tight, but mm. he did go for the best option on the far post. Up the other end, Kaiser Chiefs looking to equalize. Drops there for Solomons. Might get another bite. He's laid it off. To Sitebe, that's with Swiss Atlanti. Plays in the box, waiting the arrival of uh, the cross. Now with Mtetwa. See you there again. And he's really skewed that effort. Also one. Dual slot in that uh, 10 roll just behind uh, the striker. His ability to find space in play between the lines in the pockets is what Keza Chiefs will be expecting from him. Yes, Tetra. Dupriya took his time before lashing a shot towards goal. Once again, it's comfortable for Sage Stevens. Look how advanced Ox is in that moment. He's the man that finds the pass for, for Dupri. Um, at a little bit of time and he did not generate enough power to beat uh, Say Stevens with that shot. Now 